welcome back. It is time to go ahead and ink our character. Aren't you excited? So what we're going to do is we're going to leave this ink lines up. Uh, and we're going to go ahead and go to our paint and create a new layer and call this base paint. And once we've done that, we can go ahead and just start painting away, basically. Um, all we need to do is grab a decent sized brush, something like that will do. Um, and I'm going to start with the uh, body color, which is in here, here on the arms, and then, of course, in the face. And I'm going to make him be a kind of a, a bluebird for Twitter, like the original use was intended. So let's go ahead and we can, uh, uh, we got to actually take this white layer here and drag it beneath, like so. And... Alrighty, we're going to go ahead and up that hardness all the way, make that a little bit smaller there. And I'm just going to start painting in this character. And we're just doing the base coat for right now, which is just the primary colors. Um, so you don't have to worry about any highlights or anything yet. We'll do that in the next lessons to come. Um, so if you need to zoom in on this so you can get right along the edge, that's perfectly fine. And again, don't worry about using any other highlighting colors right now. We're going to do that later. All we're doing is laying down the base coat. Alright, that looks good. Alrighty, uh, let's see here. Let's go ahead and zoom in here a little bit. I messed up a little bit. Alrighty, here we go. Just filling in the base coat paint here. It's a pretty simple process. Just takes a little time, that's all. But uh, it will be well worth it when we're done. Alrighty, that looks good. So we'll come up in here. And you can, of course, decide on the colors that you want to use for your character. And you can separate the colors into different layers if you'd like uh, for, um, so you can change them later on. But I already know what I want, so I'm not going to worry about doing that. I'm just going to combine all the colors onto one base coat. And then do all the highlights on their own layer.
almost done with the body painting. Just have to do these last couple areas here. And of course the arm. 